Now, I can already tell you guys that this is going to be a barbaric battle. What is going on, Dragon Ball fans? Welcome back to another episode of Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkai H3 Mods. Welcome and introducing Team Cumber versus Team Vegito. Now, I'm going to try to handicap myself for this one. I'm only going to use about three characters versus five. I'm not entirely sure who I'm going to choose here, but let's not waste any more time and begin. I want to start things off with base Cumber until we transform further later on. So let's go on ahead and choose Cumber as our team leader. And again, guys, we are going to have a massive, massive like goal for this video. If we can smash out 10 million likes, then I will upload the next part of this video, hopefully by today, later on tomorrow, if you guys want to see that. And I'm trying to choose here as to who I'm going to pick. You know what? Oh my God, yes. Timebreaker Goku Black. Can you imagine how strong this dude would be if he actually was a timebreaker? And again, guys, I do want to go on ahead and set that like goal. So as many likes we can get on this video, let's go on ahead and smash out those expectations and reach that goal. I think the final character, yes, Chompruce. This is supposed to be Beerus and Chompa's Fusion. Okay, I think the stage is set. Goku Black, Timebreaker, Cumber, and the Fusion of the Gods versus Team Vegito. Super Saiyan Blue, Kaioken. He's definitely number one. Number two, if I can find our boy Son Goku, I want to incorporate uh, Ultra Instinct. Yes, because I feel like Ultra Instinct is a factor in this. And that'll be a really cool thing if UI was to be a part of this fight. But what else do we have here? We have tons of characters to choose from. And again, if you guys have missed out the previous video, check it out. Super Saiyan 3 Kefla. Hell yeah, dude. What? She'd be a problem. She would be a huge, huge problem. Okay, but aside from the typical ones, let's see if I can find my boy Gogeta. If I can't find Gogeta, then I'm guessing I'm gonna have to stick with my guns and using Vegito on this one, but seemingly enough, oh, there he is, Xeno Gogeta. All right, so uh, we're gonna go with Super Saiyan 4, just because I we already have Super Saiyan Blue, so why not have Super Saiyan 4? Now, the last person on my squad that I want to have here is going to be absorbed or at least atrocious baby vegeta great ape baby vegeta so the stage is set let's see what happens and again guys i do want to thank you all so much for your overwhelming support if you guys have missed out the previous videos check them out the links to everything will be located down below check out my gaming channel unreal royale we post lots of gaming content on there you guys might want to go in ahead check that channel out hit that sub button over there and for here the goal, the goal, the ultimate goal is to try to hit 1 million subscribers. So let's go on ahead and do this. Alright, so we've all seen what happened when, uh, when Gogeta fought Cumber. Or at least when Vegito, excuse me, fought Cumber. I'm thinking about Gogeta here because I'm just wishing that this ISO had Gogeta Blue from the DBS movie. That would have been pretty cool. But you know what's crazy too? A lot of people talk about, man, you know, what if, what if Cumber fought this person? What if Cumber fought that person? Cumber is so powerful just in base form alone that people truly don't see his influence on the entirety of the Dragon Ball Heroes universe like this dude is a problem people tend to forget he fought two versions of Vegito he fought Goku and Vegeta he fought essentially everybody and he was able to tank he was able to tank everybody he came across so easily now here what I want to know is if we had base Cumber versus Kaioken Blue Vegito who wins like right off the gate if it was one-on-one, -on -one, no interruptions between the two. Oh, he's using times 20. Okay. All right. I'm going to step it up, too. What is this? What energy attack is this? Is Vegito going to get Hakai'd? It looks like it. Dude, just imagine. Okay, so I, I wasn't able to fully have influence on Kaioken Vegito. But right now, everything is glowing red. Everything is glowing blue. I can't really tell what the hell's going on right now. But... From what I can see, it looks like Vegito is on the receiving end of an incredible beatdown. So, again guys, let me know what you all want to see in the comment section below. If there is uh, any other specific battle you guys had in mind, let me know. I'm always open to suggestions and feedback, so if you guys want to see something specific, let me know! Alright, Vegito right now is trying too hard. Let me see. Can I hit him with this? Alright, Vegito Blue. Listen, I I'm a handicap right now, so... This, uh, th th this is more- oh crap, this is more than fitting, I would have to say. Oh, damn it, I couldn't block that. Alright, we're, we're gonna have to step it up. Super Saiyan 3. Even though many people call it Super Saiyan, which is not, because once- you, you can clearly tell based on Cumber's eyebrows and the hair and stuff, like, this is Super Saiyan 3. And the fact that he has a tail right now is scary enough, because the tail obviously makes you stronger. But Super Saiyan 3, Cumber versus anybody from Super, 
that it, it's it's crazy man this dude is so strong that like like i said before i would love to see him be made canon in a way you know just his own character not not a rip-off version of him or something like that i want to see cumber cumber you feel me i want to see the actual character of cumber be made canon can i hit this dude real quick please there we go yo cumber going in for the kill shot let's see if i can if i can win this then hey it is what it is but uh, again, if you guys want to see more Parsecs battles with, my, with myself and Super Saiyan Paul, let me know down below because the way, because a lot of you guys were asking me, yo Alex, how is it that you can play, you know, Tenkaichi 3 basically online with people? And I told you guys before, it's a program called Parsecs, and Parsecs works wonders. I'm telling you all right now, I'm able to play with people for any given game, uh, so as long as we can connect PCs and have a good time. Yo, this dude's going Kaioken times 20 twice. Like, what in the world? Let me see if I can... Oh, did you see that? Yo! Cumber smash mouthing right now. Come on. You want to fight Vegito? Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm trying to run in there with my uh, with my rush attack real quick. Okay, hold on. Is he there? Is he there? Is he there? Ah, oh, he moved out the way. Kamehameha final. Please don't hit me with that. Oh, yes. Okay, cool. Now that we're going to hit our max... Oh, he's switching out! Super Saiyan 3 Kefla. Now, all right, now Kefla, Kefla got to get her her fair share of dues, man. Like she's she's a pretty intriguing character. She's pretty strong. And uh, but Cumber right now, Cumber Super Saiyan 3 versus Kefla Super Saiyan 3. I'm gonna have to give it to my boy Cumber on this one. I don't see anybody out there voting Kefla. If you do want to vote Kefla, please let me know in the comments as to why, because I don't see it personally. Oh crap, she's about to die. Oh wait a minute, what just happened? She took the she took the attack. Okay, hold on. So she took the attack, but given her status, she's not hurt. All right, we're gonna swap out. Goku Black Time Breaker. And you guys already know the Time Breaker dudes are a lot more powerful than the regular uh, standard versions of their own characters. So Time Breaker Goku Black Base versus Super Saiyan 3 Kefla guys. Let me know in the comment section below. Also, if you guys have not checked out the fan mangas on my channel, we have so many what if fan mangas created by the community created by me and a couple of my other my, my other partners and stuff so if there's anything else you guys want to see let me know in the comments because uh some of my teammates some of my partners do come up with great stories and i actually have them you know publicized or at least be, uh, have the actual mangas be created so if there's any other you know story you guys want to see if there's any other concept you guys want to see let me know in the comments and uh we can get it done for you guys and I can already see people now asking for Time Breaker Goku Black. Wouldn't that be something, right? All right, so Kefla, she's surviving somehow. I don't know why. Listen, if you fought me, let me see here. If you fought me, you'd be in trouble because Time Breakers. Listen, Time Breaker Super Saiyan 4 Bardock was able to contest against Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. So how do you explain that one? You know what I'm saying? Pretty interesting stuff here. Let's see if I can body Kefla. Listen, Kefla, you can try. Let me see. Can I hit her with this? Bam. Oh, right to the face, too. Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta is next, which I, listen, if there's any incarnation of Gogeta that I really do enjoy, it's Super Saiyan 4. I just really wish that they gave Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta a more serious tone, like the version in Dragon Ball Super Broly, because in Dragon Ball Super Broly, this dude Gogeta was not playing around. Gogeta was so serious, and he was so well-rounded in his approach, that it was a real turn-on to see what he, what he was doing, you know? He was serious in his display. He was serious in his fighting, and that's what we need. We don't need these clown fusions. Like, I hate that so much. Like, I've always hated the clown version of Gogeta. I've always hated the clown version of Vegito because that that's not that's not what I envision fusion to be. Now, although it works for, like, kids like Goten and Trunks, I just don't want it to be done to Goku and Vegeta, or, any, or more or less anybody else, for example. Uh, Kefla, she wasn't a jokey character. She was very serious, and, and that's what I liked about her. So, you know, for me... I want to see more serious characters. I hate to see characters that are always, you know, one-dimensional or they're always, you know, kind of like gag characters in a way like that. That kind of turns me off when it comes to fusions. And when you think about it, right, when has a fusion ever done anything of, of, of importance, you know what I'm saying? Aside from Gogeta against Broly, in which Gogeta was about to kill Broly, oh my Christ. Oh, wouldn't this be a fight? Damn, that Kamehameha was strong, dude. Okay, son Goku. Let's see. What do I need to do to get a better review? Now, this is... This is... Wow, this is Xeno uh, Ultra Instinct Goku. So, I'm gonna have to... Let's see. Connect. There we go. 
Alright, how much damage is this going to do? Because if we can't do enough damage, we're gonna have to swap out. Oh yeah, we're, de we're definitely gonna have to swap out here. Alright, this is the fusion of the two destroyers. Come on, guys. Look at this. Imagine the power between a fusion like this. Two Hakaishins fusion. Yo, uh, with, with, with a mega fusion like two Hakaishins, let me know in the comments, guys, who would win? Ultra Instant Goku or a fusion between two gods? Or more or less, like, just anybody else. Do you guys think, like, like an angel would win? Like, for example, Whis versus two Hokaishin fusions or whatever the case may be. I, I would love to know your thoughts on two Hokaishins seemingly enough using the Metamaris fusion, right? And being that we don't have, you know, the Potara version, can you imagine a Potara fusion between two gods? That would be insane. Oh, crap. Okay, so Goku has tapped into his his potential. Alright, so he has the heat, he has the aura. Listen, homie. Oh, what the hell? Oh, what in the world was that? I have no idea, but I'm about to unleash a gigantic Hakai. Hakai. It's over. Son Goku, if you survive this, you are truly extraordinary. Yep, he survived this. You are indeed extraordinary, my friend. Because no mortal, listen to my words, no mortal survives a Hakai. Not one, dude. And you know what the thing is also, guys? I think I'm honestly one of the only ones in this community doing Tenkai H3 mods, which is pretty cool because I want to make everyone else aware as to how dope this game is. Whoa. Where? Oh, there he is. There he is. Mm, I see you there, baby Vegeta. There's no way. Yeah, baby Vegeta would get destroyed. Grade A baby Vegeta would get annihilated, dude. And I'm surprised that he's as agile. Whoa. I'm surprised that he's as agile as he comes right now. Let me see. Because, oh crap. Oh, whoa. We're going to have to back up here. We're going to have to use out. Okay, hold on. Baby Vegeta's getting a bit out of hand here. We're going to have to put the, the great monkey down. I see. Yes. All right, here we go. Hakai time, baby. Oh, am I going to miss? I think I am. Oh, crap. There we go. We got him. We got him, boys. Hakai. I love when Beerus, when he says it. Hakai. All right, listen, baby. Listen, boy. You may be big, but you're not that strong. A against a double fusion deity, you're not winning this. You are about to get hakai Why is my eye red? But I, what, what I really want to know from you guys is how strong a fusion like this would be. Like, real talk. Because a fusion like this would be so intense, man. A, a, a freaking destroyer fusion. I, I bet you now people are going to be like, oh, man, what about... What about an angel fusion? Can you can you even imagine an angel fusion? For example, like, you know, Whis and like, you know, I don't know, like just Mojito fusion or whatever. Like that that that's just that's insane. These dudes would be so strong. But I still wonder how strong would they be compared to, for example, the Dai Shinkan. You know what I'm saying? That's that raises intrigue. Alright, okay. This dude's too strong, bro. Come on. Get out of the way. I'm gonna summon. I'm gonna summon my boy, Kamba. There we go. Where's my boy, Cumber? All right, Cumber's in the mix. Time for us to unleash another attack. All right, down goes baby. Who is next? Is it Vegito? It's gotta be. Yep. We have some unfinished business there. Saiyan. Saiyajin go. All right, dude. Stop blasting me with your crappy ass Kamehamehas. And why don't you fight me like a true Saiyan? Let's see here. And again, guys, this is an older ISO. We have tons of different other ISOs. The ISOs that have, like, Super Saiyan 5 Cumber, Super Saiyan 4 Cumber, Moro, all these other, you know, characters like Mirrors and stuff. So, you know, it is what it is. We're going to have to... Oh, damn, dude. We're going to have to... Uh, oh, my God. We're going to have to wait and see what the community creates in, in the coming future for us to see some badass characters. Kefla got to go, bro. Kefla, you got to go. There we go. Kicked her right in the jaw. All right, so here's a guy that we haven't fought yet. Gogeta da. All right, let's see. Can we stop him? Oh, he moved out of the wave just in the nick of time. All right, so I'm going to power up. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, there we go. We survived. We survived. Oh, I'm in your face. I'm in your face, homeboy. What are you going to do? Oh, what are you going to do? Hold on. Gogeta got to suffer, man. Gogeta has to feel the wrath. If he doesn't, then, we, then, we, then we're not doing our job. All right, down goes Gogeta. Hold on. We're going to have to increase our power even more. Listen, this is Super Saiyan 3 Cumber, bro. Super Saiyan 3 Cumber stomps out Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. Like, isn't that crazy, guys? Isn't that freaking bananas? Like, this dude stomps out Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. Another one. Yeah, this entire team is basically finished. If I can get my hands on everybody... I mean, so far, our characters are, like... 
Aside from Cumber, probably. Everyone's in good shape. Oh, man, look at this. Cumber stomping, dude. Come here, Gogeta. You're gonna have to feel our pain. Oh, there we go. Yo, Gogeta has no chance right now. Maybe if it was blue, then, then I mean, sure. But let me see. What, what, what chance do I have here? Oh, there we go. Look at this. A full-powered... I'm gonna take this as full-powered. A full-powered Super Saiyan 3 Cumber. Just letting this man eat dust right now. This is scary, dude. This is so bad. A 90-hit combo right now. A 90-hit combo from our boy Kamba. Let's see. Let's see what else we can do here. But yeah, on the previous video, guys, I asked you guys if I should do a New Year's video or at least a, a December 2019 video showcasing all of the ISOs that I've done for this game at the end of the year. And the reason why I ask you guys this is because some of you guys were asking me, "Yo, Al, are you planning on showcasing more of these ISOs by the end of the year?" And I said to myself, "You know what? That would be really cool." if we can do another uh, another one of those videos again because the last one we did it was about an hour long and I think I showcased like I showcased a bunch of different ISOs for the game so if you guys want to see another one by the end of the year please let me know in the comments uh, I guess you could say hashtag year end Dragon Ball and I'll, I'll do that for you guys all right this dude's pissing me off Gogeta is pissing me off can Cumber come back from it let's find out let's see if I can just stomp this dude yo how many times Okay, I see. Alright, I'm gonna swoop in. Oh! Alright, come on, come on, Kamba! There we go, Cumber got the better of Goku on this one. Yep, you can try, but you will ultimately fail. Now eat my finisher. Can I connect? Oh, that, dude, dude, that's like an instant connect attack. That is, that is really, oh, there goes the entire planet. Wow. Okay, so, we did more damage than I anticipated, which I was not expecting. And another one. Another one for Son Goku. Son Goku! Yeah, he's done. There we go. Down goes UI. Now, who's next? Super Saiyan 4 Fusion? You got it, buddy. You're about to be the next one on the shit list. And then after that, I do believe all we have left is Vegito, and then we are done! Damn, dude. Damn, 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 damn. Come on, Cumber. Defeat Gogeta. This Alright, this is getting intense. Hold on, hold on. Cumber right now. Cumber coming in with that clutch. Oh, can I hit him with this attack? Oh yeah, it's done. I'm swapping out. I'm gonna swap out for my God Fusion. Alright, so it's Vegito versus this dude. Oh my Christ. Alright, hold on. Vegito Kaioken times 20. Alright. I'll, I'll, I'll give this dude some leeway. Alright, can I hit him? Aw, oh, dude, come on. I'm trying to hit him with that attack, and it's obviously not working. And he got me with some good Key Blast there, so can I... Aw, oh, is it effective? Is it effective? Alright, it's not that effective, but it still did some damage, so... Damn, Gogeta. Let's, I mean, Vegito, sorry, but whatever. Either, either Fusion would have fallen to me by now, like, regardless. I'm just trying to, like, I'm just trying to beat Homeboy around. Let's see. Oh, can I hit him with this? Oh, we got him. Yep, any last words before you die? Kaioken times 20? Okay. I, I, I could live with this. I'll let him use Kaioken times 20. Because in a matter of a few seconds, I'm about to unleash my ultimate attack. Watch this any minute now. Go ahead, Vegito. Go ahead. Have your fun. Have your fun. Now it's time for me to have my fun. Are you ready? Hakai. It's over. This dude just got erased. Sorry, homie. That was a really good fight, though. I'm not going to lie. Three versus five. I might do more of those. But either way, guys, let me know what you all think in the comment section below. Thank you all so much for watching, guys. Once more, if you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, guys. The road to 1 million subscribers continues. Slap a like on the video. Share the video. Subscribe to my other three channels, guys. Unreal Network, Unreal Vlogs, and Unreal Royale. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll be seeing you all down in the comment section below. Have a great day, everybody. Peace. This is the perfect being. Before I destroy your favorite heroes, I'm going to need you to subscribe to the perfect channel, Unrelent Gaming, and turn on notifications to never miss a single upload. Also, follow Unrelent Gaming on these social media platforms to stay connected at all times. And if you don't, then very soon you will all be dead. <laughs> Along with your entire planet.